friends! In today's video, I'm sharing some before Christmas homemaking inspiration. I have some laundry, cleaning, baking, and general homemaking to do, and I thought I'd bring you along. Whatever the season, I always have a ton of laundry to do, so I started today by folding a few loads left over from last night. Having a few candles lit made it a bit cozier. Do you try and make Monday tasks more special by lighting candles or adding music? I feel like these little things make it easier to get through chores that I don't otherwise enjoy doing. having some friends over for dinner tonight and I wanted to dress up the dining room table a little bit. Before I did that I wanted to iron this linen tablecloth. It had been stuffed in a basket and needed ironed badly. I've had this little ironing board for a long time but I think it's probably time to upgrade to a bigger ironing board because this tabletop one isn't nearly enough space to iron larger items. once it's ironed, although linen seems like it wrinkles when you look at it, but I guess that's the beauty of it.
Next, I'm going to bake these soft gingerbread cookies. I love gingerbread, but I really like a soft cookie instead of a crispy cookie. So these are a great combination of the two, and they're really easy to make. I'll link the recipe in the description box below. The plants in my daughter's room were looking a little wilted. I try to water them once a week or once every other week depending on the plant, but I think it'd been several weeks and they were looking a little sad. Luckily, most of our house plants are pretty hardy and forgiving and can live through my neglect. Our cat's been hanging out on this chair lately, so it was covered in cat hair and really needed vacuumed.
before the holiday. It feels so refreshed. Next, I wanted to give the bathroom a quick little clean. I try to wipe down the mirror, sink, and toilet every few days. I added a little cup of holiday greenery to the bathroom to give it a little more holiday spirit as well. I think it's the little touches that elevate our ordinary experience into something special. That's what makes Christmas and the holidays so special. Finally, I added a few of my favorite Christmas books to our coffee table. I love Christmas books. When I was a kid, Christmas books were one of my favorite parts of the season. These are a few of my current favorites. Let me know in the comments if you have a favorite Christmas book. I'd love to hear your suggestions. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Merry Christmas.